So let's break down the transmosis so people really get a good understanding. How does it actually work? And when you say, um, you know, a clearing, things of that nature, what is that really like? And how do you do that? And how do you know when it's happened? Um, sure. What happens is someone wants a session. Now, people have said, hey, whatever spirit wants. I'm like, but no, I want to give you exactly what right. your, right. is in your highest and greatest right. good. Participate, right. So I asked them, okay, what do you want to work on physically, right. emotionally, mentally, spiritually? Well, isn't it all one thing? Yes, but there's different levels. Right. Like there's feelings. Right. They're invisible, but we have them. But so I know they exist. Thoughts, that's mental. They exist, but they're invisible. It's not like I'm touching it, right? Right. So I ask people to be responsible, like to actually get conscious about what they need to work with. They might not know, and that's fine. So they tell me what they want to work on, on all those levels, and then I created a map of anything and everything where a disconnect or a wound, spiritual wound, unconscious something, trauma that happened. And, and I muscle test, which is called applied kinesiology. Right. And I ask, show me the truth. Yes or no. Positive, false, whatever. When you're looking at the muscles, are you looking for stiffness, tightness, blockages? What are you looking well, for? Well, they're not with me. So mm. they fill out the form online. Yeah. Right? And then I use my map. And I muscle, I call you in. Let's just use you for an example. Yeah. Sure. I call Jim in in 100% pure divine light. And we're right? going to do a session later, too, which is exciting. <laughs> Thank you. I'm ready. And, um, and then I call myself in and I ask, oops, I ask to be uh, a pure divine channel for truth, wisdom, and healing love for the client's highest and greatest good. So you talk about being a caregiver and being of service. I am actually just asking, intending, manifesting that for my client. And then I use my map and I muscle test myself. What is it? What do they need? Mm. So I muscle test. So I muscle test my muscle. Mm. But it's not about muscles. It's about anatomy. It's about bodies. Right. It's about systems. 80% mm -hmm. of the time, wounds and disconnects get lodged in the nervous system, the endocrine system, and the chakra system. So here's some of that structure that I got from Vicki and Jean, right, right in the right. multidimensional body balancing. And then I, I consecrate the session, meaning I call in your guys of 100% mine, and we ask for your highest and greatest good. And then I pretty much say, show me. And then I get shown. And I share what I hear and what I see. And then I record the session. The good, the bad, the indifferent, whatever it is. It's never bad. Really? Now, it it's could fun. be bad. The first time the person worked with me, She's like, oh, I saw you when you died one time and this happened. And I'm like, oh, God, you know, it, it's just how it worked through her. So it comes through different for different people. But I'm combining, I'm synergizing energy work courses that I've taken, such as Access Consciousness, Healing Touch. I, I pull it all together and I've created a package that works. And I don't mean package as in marketing package, but like a a way that really hones in and what will help. Like the hands have chakras, you can hold a pendulum over them and it'll clear your field for you. Chakras, I wanna make sure the energy's flowing. Right. And I share what I hear and I see, and it's co-creative. Right. You can talk too, but sometimes it just comes so fast. I'm like a FedEx commercial. It's like, you beep, just, beep, 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 yeah, beep. Yeah. I just share it because it keeps it coming. Right. So how do I know it's cleared? Right. I get, I, I am shown. So it might look like a shadow or a darkness, like a, like remember the movie Minority Report where they had those oh, clear yeah. screens and right. they pull things up on it. That's what it's kind of like. And then I look at the nervous system. I go, oh, maybe we should clear out a little bit there and thyroid or whatever. And so I just share it, and that's why. And I don't always remember what I say, but it comes back. 